All right. This is one fifth of story fandom. Max is back here, so technically two fifths, but you don't want to know what he's doing. Yeah. Um. Anyway, so I am back with Crisis on Infinite Earths Part Four. Um. Part three was pretty traumatic, so hopefully they can figure a way out of this. Um, but today I'm in an extra good mood, so I'm sure it's going to dash that. But I'm in a good mood because got my Baby Yoda. You know, gotta love Baby Yoda stuff. And it's new comic book day, so, you know, plenty to read, plenty to do. And I'm finally back with Crisis on Infinite Earths. So, but, um... Before we get started, if anyone has any ideas for other comic books I should read that are really good or anything like that, or any other shows I should try since we're getting to the end of Crisis on Infinite Earths, uh, comment with them. Um, I am going to be watching Chilling Adventures of Sabrina, but I don't know if anyone wants to see reactions to that. So, uh, comment with ideas, thoughts. Ideas for comic books and shows for me to watch. And I think that's about it. But let's get right into it, shall we? Let's see. Reaction window. There we go. We are ready. I love you. I love you. Thank you. Thank you. It's like a goodbye, I love you. Jeez. Couldn't that design something a tad less bulky? Remind me again, why did I marry you? You have a thing for men of powering ambition. <laughs> Doing this all. That's what happens when people mess around with stuff they shouldn't. Like, really. Every time. So, dear death, a lot of ways to describe Lex Luthor. Ah, idiot! Why couldn't I be trapped at the edge of eternity with someone possessing more than 200 IQ points? But I find douchebag to be the most descriptive. We've lost too many good people already. Thanks for volunteering, Lex. Well, that's very kind. <laughs> Is it because I killed your parallel reality cousin? Why is it always got to be up to Oliver? Can't he just relax? Awkward. It always is. Yeah, I'm with him. He just touched his head. It's weird. <laughs> she just lets Lex fall. <laughs> I don't blame her, but. Thanks for the kind assist. And he's gone. Where's Lex? You turned your back on him. Oh, do you want a selfie, bro? No, no, I'm not, sorry. I don't, we're not. No, I'm. 
Also, the flash. Comfy. It's just pretty cool. It's Ooh, seems safe and breathable. <laughs> Okay. That was pretty cool. In a contest of mind over muscle, mind wins every time. But in Pokemon, it's true. Mind only gives support. Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> All right. What are you up to, Lex? Universal domination, of course. What the hell? She needs to stop thinking that she can just, like, control Lex Luthor. Like, it never ends well. <sighs> I'm just saying. Actually, I think I do. And I'm gonna stop it. Who are you? <laughs> Awkward. I've never been knocked unconscious on an alien planet before. It's pretty much the same as being knocked unconscious on Earth. No fucking bones. <laughs> Poor guy. I know. Engaging quantum portal. I wouldn't do that. Don't take it personally. We'll stop trying to kill each other. Got through to Nova. He just ruined a perfectly good bad guy plan. You know that new guy? <laughs> What's sad is he's right. There's always just one guy, that's all it takes, right? In a multiverse, all it takes is one version of him. And they end up there anyways. Right, Max? Right. I don't know. Why do you cosmic types always have to be so obtuse? Oh, I knew, I tell you. I don't. All I have to do is follow the rules. Well, that's what you're supposed Nobody wants to point out that Lex is not a paragon. What is Lex gonna do? Think of the death? And Ryan, Joy, come on! Right? Oh no, well, technically, Luther gave himself powers. Of course, that's what he would say. <laughs> I like Lex. No! Come on, Oliver. So this is what being a hero feels like. Interesting. Where's Oliver? <laughs> I made myself the paragon of truth. What if truth can tell us what we need to do? I'm not gonna lie, I got chills. I got chills, guys. I mean, it's also cold, but yeah. This is new.
So that was a hard episode. I mean, they did it, at least, but... That sucked. Right? Well, I don't really know what to say after that. Um, I guess there's really not a lot to say. Um, I guess like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you next episode when they officially rip my heart out and squash it to teeny pieces. Right? Talking to Max, nobody can see it. But he is right here. <laughs> there you go, see? He saw his nose. He was trying to make sure I was okay. Because um, he's a good dog. Well, until next time, guys.